Please tell me that jerk in room 24 got discharged. Oh, thank god. I was just about ready to sucker punch that guy. He was such a dick. Eh, well, with the amount of alcohol he had in his bloodstream, I'm honestly not surprised. No shit. So, Gina put him in his place? <laughs> Good. Someone needed to. Oh, yeah. Well, the new place is great. We actually just finished unpacking the last of our stuff. Moving always does take so long. Yeah, it's our first place together. Uh-huh, so far, so good. It's nice to come home after a shift and see them. I always look forward to it. <laughs> Shut up, dude. I know it's happy. I just... I'm happy. For the first time in a long time. <laughs> Thank you. And hey, if you ever feel like getting back into the dating scene, do let me know. I'm sure I could arrange a date or two. <laughs> alright, alright, fine. Anyways, I'm due for my lunch, so I'm just gonna duck out while it's quiet. Paging for Dr. Indeed. Please come to room 4. Paging for Dr. Indeed. Please come to room 4. Ah. Or not. Ah, oh, crap. Why does this always happen to me? Right, right. No rest for the wicked. Intake gonna bring them to room 4? Alright, I'll just grab my chart then. Uh, let's see... Just another crazy day. Hey, Rich. What we got? Found unconscious at the bottom of the stairs? Really? No, I just... I just didn't think anyone else was actually that clumsy. I mean, aside from my partner. Did they remember anything? Ah, okay. They're probably gonna need a CT scan then. I'll just have a look and see what we're dealing with. Hi, I'm Dr... Holy shit. Sweetness? Ugh, is that supposed to make me laugh? What the hell happened? Ugh, alright, look. Look at me. Follow the light with your eyes. Don't move your head. Don't move your head, sweetness. Ah, <sighs> okay. Your right pupil is dilated. Do you have any bruises? Your side? Uh, let me see. Does it hurt when I press here? Easy, easy. Alright, I'm stopping. Seems like you cracked a rib or two on your fall. Sweetness, have you eaten today? Ah, <sighs> look, don't dance around the answer. Just tell me. <sighs> For fuck's sake. I know you have to work, so do I. But you're so deep in your work that it's starting to take a toll on you. If someone hadn't found you at the bottom of the stairs, who knows what would have happened? Or what if you like cracked your head or had internal bleeding? I can go on and on, and I will when we're home. For right now, we need to get to the bottom of this. Starting with a CT scan, blood work, and x-rays, just to be safe. Well, you should have thought of that before you neglected your health and passed out. <sighs> Tough love is exactly what you need. You think I'm not? You're sitting in my ER with a concussion and bruises. Of course I'm fucking worried. Hey, 
Are you dizzy? Take it easy. Just breathe through it, okay? I'm right here. Let's do this together. Deep breaths in. Good, good. And out. Hmm. I don't like how pale you are. Let's just check your oxygen saturation. It won't hurt. I just need your finger. Try not to talk. Just let the oximeter do its work. Eighty-nine percent. Shit. That's... that's too low. We need to get some oxygen in you. Hey, hey. You're gonna be okay. Well, for one thing, I'm a great doctor. For another, I kind of like you, so I'm pretty sure I want you to stick around. So I'll be working at just about 120% capacity. It's gonna be okay. Alright? There's no need to apologize. Just take better care of yourself. Alright? I don't like seeing you run down like this. And why are you working so hard, huh? What? Why would I be disappointed in you? Hey, 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 slow down. You're not making any sense. <sighs> Sweetness. So, all that overtime, all that extra stuff, you were just trying to lay the work for a promotion? Listen to me. I understand why you want to contribute to our finances, why you want things to work as 50-50, but not like this. You know I'm a doctor. I make more because that's just the way the world works. So if we have to split the rent 70 to 30, it doesn't bother me. What bothers me is seeing you like this. I love you, doofus. Okay. Then, no more of this, alright? We're a team. We take care of each other. Alright. So, stop worrying about something that doesn't need your concern. Now then, I know you're oxygen deprived, if you're saying sappy stuff like that. <laughs> alright. I'm gonna go and place the orders for the test. I'll be right back. So you just sit tight, and take it easy.